more difficult than it needed to be. All right, uh, just started as a scent. For once, we're not in the Peak District. I've come slightly further afield. I'm in the Yorkshire Dales, uh, climbing Burke's Fell. Um, and I think, while we're, well, I don't think, we're, while we're up there, we're gonna find a spot somewhere near Burke's Tarn and have a wild camp. Um, parked in the village of Lytton, just near a uh, pub, I think it's called Queen's Head. Or something like this, Queen Summit. And uh, we're making a 1204 foot ascent up to the summit of Burke's Fell. It's one of the Yorkshire Dales 30, I think uh, the, the Dales 30, I think they're called, which is there are 30 summits which are all above 2000 foot above sea level. Um, seemed like a nice little challenge to follow on from the Ethels, so I thought I'd come and do my first one this evening and while we're here we'll have a wild camp. Um, I think when we get a little bit higher up I'll be able to give some better views. Um, we've probably only done 200-300 foot worth for a cent at the moment, but when we get up top we should be able to see over Penny Ghent, which is one of the famous Yorkshire Three Peaks. So we're going to carry on, and I'll uh, I'll talk to you on route. It's like the Peckham Spring that don't get better than that. Just coming out at out at hillside. Marvellous. This last step that I've just took gets me above 510 metre. Summit is 610. So there's less than 100 metre of ascent to go. I don't know if you can see down there. I can see it with naked eye. But that's, that's lit and that's where I've come from. And uh, this has been a nice ascent. Uh, not not technically difficult, it's a nice ish path to walk on, but every single step has been up. There has not been one bit of flat ground, there's not been one little dip, every bit has been up, up, up. And I'm feeling it if I'm honest with you. Uh, now I've got out of the habit of climbing the Ethels, you know, two or three, four ascents a week. <sighs> this has been a difficult. No wonder I'm looking a bit red in the cheeks. Anyway, I think I'll probably talk to you again at top. And uh, then we'll see what plan is for evening. We might pitch up straight away, I don't know. I'll see you soon. Oh. So it's finally flattened out. We've got this nice path to walk on as well. And uh, we're just going to make our way up to actual summit now. I believe there's a cairn marking the summit. And I think I can see it um, over to my left. But it'll not be very well visible on on my camera phone so and um, we're just gonna swing right and grab that trig point that's just peeking up there I think that is Firth Fell trig point I think I'm not sure I'll have a look what its actual name is but we'll go and grab it anyway <laughs> up to summit of Burke's Fell now, passing Burke's Tarn. I think we'll go and get the, the summit tonight and then drop back down to Burke's Tarn. I mean when I say drop back down it's gonna it's like 
it's about five meter lower and about 50 meter in distance so it's not exactly an hardship to do it so um we'll sort that when we get up there so it's about seven o'clock now uh sunset about eight i think but i'm gonna pitch up more or less straight away there's there's i, I mean i arrived in Lytton at about quarter past five and i've not seen uh, anyone else um so i'm not gonna mess about it, it, it doesn't seem the most popular of spots this so i'm just gonna get pitched up and uh then we'll have a get settled in for evening so it's time to leave this path and head off up to the summit that you can see just there, about centre on the screen now. You can, I can see it with eye, naked eye, quite easily. But that's the summit of Berks Fell. And uh, this way is going to take us past Berks Town. Just walking past this little thing. Tell you what, if it were a bit more cleared out, that'd be handy to, to keep in there. Because it's nice and sheltered. Obviously we're a building of some kind at some point. A window there. I mean, I suppose I'm not stopping me pitching and utilising the shelter, but I want to go over near that tarn, Burke's tarn. So we're just going to get to that cairn first. You can see just there, central. Probably only 10 minutes away now. And then depending on what spots are like there, I might pitch there. Or I might head back to tarn, I'm not really sure. We'll see. Feeling quite good though now, now we're, that, that ascent were pretty heavy but we're happy now so all good oh, oh yes oh. wow This is what 2,000 foot above sea level gets you. Magic.